Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy David back with another video. Yeah, baby. Uh, you know, I'm on my awesome powers, awesome powers thing from now on. So uh, today, you guys know what's going on right now. There's a lot of there's a lot of beef going on on my channel right now. You know what I'm saying? Now, uh, I've actually so there's there's beef going on with me and Terrell basically, or silly To as you guys know him as. I know him as Terrell. Now, uh, we have been around each other. We have been very cordial around each other. It's just like I'm just not talking to him basically. It's just like I'm gonna just leave it at. I'm not chilling with him. I'm not talking to him. Nothing. Nothing like that no more. Uh, I haven't been keep. I haven't really been like. I've been keeping my space. How about that? But. The whole point of this video is I've been get, I actually went through the comments on the video about me sending a message to uh, Terrell, right? Basically, uh, a lot of you guys are saying, "Yo, it's not like it was like 50-50. It was like it's Terrell was childish for doing it." We all we've all we've all definitely established that, right? Also, you guys are saying Chino is in the wrong for doing this. Now Chino's inside. Chino doesn't even know I'm even gonna do this video. Uh, I was like, yo, I definitely need to confront him. I need a, I need a genuine reaction from you, Chino. I'm gonna talk to you about this off camera. We're gonna talk about it on camera because obviously we, there's a lot of beef going on. Like, there's, there's definitely, I'm, I, I, I definitely am gonna keep starting with the pot because I am the one that's definitely wrong right now, basically. So, I'm gonna go and call Chino down from downstairs, upstairs, and confront him about why he decided to leave the footage in there because I didn't even know the footage was being left in the video. I didn't. I didn't give I didn't give it the go, I didn't give it the say so, I didn't give the green light, nothing. It was just like, yo, uh, he basically just edited, left in the video, even like went into the went as far as like zooming in and all that other stuff and slowing it down, bam, it's in the video. So without further ado, we're gonna go inside right now. I'm gonna sit set the camera up. I'm gonna tell Chino we're gonna talk on camera. I'm gonna let him know right off rip. We need to have a talk on camera. Let's get it. Yo, Chino. Uh, can you come downstairs real quick? I gotta talk to you about something. Oh, what? Just uh, come downstairs, bro. Well, oh, I gotta talk to you about something, bro. It's like it's serious. All right, so as you can see, the camera's already on. Mm. So, um, I need to talk to you about the spelling bee video because uh, I'm getting a lot of backlash mm -hmm. about why it was not it was not even edited out of the video, basically. You never said not to edit it out. But like, you already know. I mean, obviously, it made the video juicier, it made the video funnier, which is, I know that's why you wanted to keep the clip. Mm -hmm. But like, me, you never really like, was like, yo, like, would you like want me to take this out because like it's embarrassing or like bro it was already painful enough for me to edit that exactly so all like, i saw would, was wouldn't it have been easier to just snip snip would it have been easier yes but would it have been funnier no so like you just you should have told me to edit it out that's i not, wasn't that's not my that. fault you know how because I if i were you i'd have been like you know you gotta cut that out Okay, but really like, was that big I was ne I was never really home. I'm never really home, am I? I'm really it gone don't matter. all day. You have like, a phone? Huh? Do you have a phone? Yeah, but like okay. I just assumed you would cut it out. No. So like you're gonna you're gonna choose all footage that I film, I upload. I just cut stuff to make it like you know more dramatic. So like you're gonna choose funnier mm -hmm. over your roommate's like. You could have told me. I don't. I want you to cut that part out. That's not my fault. But like, I shouldn't. At the end of the day, it. your problem isn't with me; it's with T.O. But like, I started saying whenever I did that message T.O. with you and Valentine, people were like, it was like 50 50 split. Like, why didn't Chino cut it out? Which is true. Or, I mean, for one, Terrell shouldn't even done well, it. Well, let me ask you this: Why didn't you bother to tell me? Because you seen me edit the video. I only saw you. I you saw, saw me edit. I was video. editing the video the whole day. But I wasn't. You home. were home. Not the whole you were day. Home. And I assume you were still there. The point. You heard me editing the video. You could have been like, Chino, cut that part out. 
Bro, that's not my fault. I literally you have assumed. a mouth, you have a phone, you should have, you should No, that's like, that's like basically me that's saying not, like, no, it's not my, it literally was like, don't, don't blame me. Bro, don't I, blame the me. whole thing is I'm just confronting you on it because I need to understand that's like, fine. Well, I'm telling you right now, it's not my fault. I didn't depend you. I understand that, but I you did, had all you the have, power in the world you to not make it, make it public. To come up and approach me or text me and be like, yo, I don't want that part in there. That's all you had to do. If you really didn't feel that comfortable. If okay, not, so you let, know it was for, you know tables. you were filming a video. Let's check the tables. B, you know that that happened in the Bro, video. you're not letting me talk. I'm and just saying C, like. You could have messaged me and told me to take it out. Okay, of let's turn the tables again, right? Don't. You said you were pants in the in uh in my previous video. It like you've been pants. Yeah. So let's turn the table. Let's say I was conducting this swelling bee. Terrell pants you, and I left it in my. Video. If I didn't want it in there, I would have told you. If I didn't care, I'd have been like, "It's cool." So how would you feel right now if that if this if you were in my shoes? Would you have if wanted me was, to leave it in, if in it the was video? like that? I wouldn't care. You wouldn't care. 100%. You would just leave it in there for funny and laughing jokes. What movie? At the end of the day, I still, like me personally, like I told you in the car, bro, I wouldn't be mad at Tio. I would not hold a grudge. I would just, I would talk to him, and I would tell him that's not cool, and it's over with. But I'm not like, oh, bro, it's over with, and will ever be your friend. What am I, eight? No. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying, like, I'm just going to take my space. That's why I'm like, I'm being, I'm doing it in a mature way. Around. I mean, I've been around him. I, they've already seen me around him. Yeah. Like cordially, uh -huh. but it's not like I'm messing with them anymore. That's your choice, brother. So like, next video, if anything happens, I'm gonna just tell you to cut that. Yeah. If there's something that you don't like, welcome to YouTube, sir. If there's something that you don't like, future blah blah blah, cut that out. It has nothing to do with me. Brother. I'm not trying to start beef with you because you're my roommate. I don't care. I'm just saying that I felt like it was fair that I <laughs> confronted you. You're not trying to serve me because you don't get nowhere else to go. <laughs> you have to go home. Yeah. I'm telling you right now, you and everybody watching, that is not my fault. You could have just simply asked me to take it out. So if I would have asked you to take it out, you would have taken it out? You would have taken it out? Yeah, of course. 100%. So like, if I asked you to take the video down, you would take the video down? Am I going to take the video down? No, I can edit it and cut that part out. All right. Well, all right, guys. So clearly that didn't go how I wanted it to go. Uh, honestly, I couldn't really say much because Chino, Chino really is. He really can't get involved in the beef. Like if if I wanted it deleted, if I really cared that much when it happened, it really wouldn't have went up. But the whole point is, I think I'm not gonna start beef with my roommate. Like that, that shit. That that's dead. That's definitely dead. Because then. I really would have to go back missing, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but that's beside the point. Um, that was still, I think it's still gonna fall back on, it's definitely always gonna fall back on Tio. That's the whole bottom line. This whole thing was caused by Terrell literally just being childish. Like, there's, there's, no, there's no if, and, or buts about it, and I need to confront him. This, uh, this whole little confrontation to Chino, uh, it needed to happen. It needed to be said and done because, yeah, Chino definitely did, uh, Chino, he had the power to edit it out. He had the power to just cut, cut, delete, you know what I'm saying? But, realistically, I didn't ask. I wasn't embarrassed, but that was my, that was me being stupid. I was definitely assuming Chino would just delete that clip. Whenever I found out the clip wasn't deleted, I was like, oh, shit. Like, I was, uh, even more embarrassed, but I can always... Now let me know in the comments section down below, like, I don't know, clearly, if I asked you to take the whole video down, that is his money, that is his, ha his ad revenue, it is his views, it is on his channel, that is a video that he spent money to set up for, which I did win, by the way, you know what I'm saying? Um, now, I don't know, I feel like that, that's right, I feel like that's definitely fair, if I just go and ask, uh, if I go and ask, you know, if he can definitely just go on YouTube and just trim that part out because that can be done. That definitely 100% can be done. I actually did it earlier on one of my videos whenever I messed up on something, you know what I'm saying? So I know for a fact uh, that is an easy like little fix it thing. But I don't know, I think it's, it's, already, it's already on the internet. Like there's not really much I can do about it. Like I, I guarantee it's already been clipped, it's already been made a meme, like all that. Like 
is done and over with, literally. Uh, so, I just wanted you guys to know that I'm not just only mad at Terrell. There is some like, there's some like heat in the water. There's like, there's some heated water. It's not just like smooth sailing. There's like, there's some bumps in the, there's, there's some waves with the sailboat, me and Chino. But it's like, uh, it is my fault at the end of the day that I did not ask him personally, text him, call him, anything, because I wasn't home. I was here whenever he first started editing the video, then I bounced. I didn't know he was going to finish the video by the time I got home, because Chino does take a long time to edit videos. But by the time I got home, it was too late, already rendered, already scheduled, and bam, bam, boom. And I really, I didn't even ask him. I didn't even know he was going to edit, edit the video that day, realistically. I knew he was editing, I didn't know he was editing that video. Now, I'm definitely stuck in between a rock and a hard place. Confronting Chino was something that I needed to be, needed to be done to show you guys that I'm not only mad at Terrell, right? Uh, but it's not like I can cause too much beef with my own roommate. It's realistic, that's, this is realistic. That's just me asking to get thrown out on the street. Or if I cause so many problems, like, all right, bye, like, bet. Uh, with Tio, it's a different story. Tio's the one that actually did the action. And like I said, I'm still going to stand on this. It's not the embarrassment. It's the principle, bro. It's the principle that out of everybody you picked, you picked me. That's, that's just bottom line. So I think my next step now, guys, is, is to either confront T.O. Or maybe I need to get advice from Dub or DDG, Vaughn, like his actual, like his brother, his cousins. Like basically my family. I mean, I can even go as far as like going to Mama, Mama DDG and asking her if what I should, what she thinks I should do in the situation. Cause I really don't know. Like Terrell's been my homie for too long and I'm not gonna be a bitch about the situation. Like I'm not gonna let him pantsing me kill our whole friendship. Cause obviously we've been cordial, right? Uh, we've been very cordial in other people's videos because I'm not gonna disrespect somebody else's video. Cause that's just not in me. That's just not, it's not, it's not, I mean, Terrell has neither. Terrell has not caused any problems. Like he said, he has no problems with me. He said, if I want to beef, I'm, I'm going to beef, which is what I'm doing. Um, I'm going to be completely cordial. That's just the person I am until I'm ready to completely confront him on this or just get him back, basically. So that's, that's going to do it for this video. I confronted Chino. It, he definitely made some very good points. Um, and that's, that's, all there, that, that's all there is, bro. Like that's literally all I can do. So if you guys think I don't have problems with Chino, now you guys know I have been feeling lately and I did it to show you guys what is going on right now. And if you guys have already made it this far in the video, I'm going to go ahead and switch up my whole energy because this is my outro. Um, go ahead and make sure to like this video up. If you're new to the channel, I want to go ahead and say welcome. Welcome to the beef between YouTubers because this is real. Everybody will be like, yo, David's just going to have cut. Like, no. Or they're just trying to cause problems for David to get caught. Or, like, more clout for both of them. Like, nah. This is 100% real, guys. Like, this, this face, this is not like, he, 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 fake YouTuber beef. I'm getting more clout. Like, no. This shit's real. All right? So, don't come to my comment section talking about, uh, oh, this shit fake. Oh, you and T.O. cool. Oh, you and the whole squad cool. Like, no. I'm tired of dealing with the bullshit. And... That's bottom line. So, if you haven't turned on post notifications yet, please go ahead and do that for me. And I just want to say, it's David, and I'm out. Peace.